breaking news at five. We're following from the capital city. Hartford will require masks indoors. In fact, starting at midnight, everyone over the age of two will need to mask up in businesses and schools. So this is a big change for the upcoming school year. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Savino is joining us right now from the capital city with more on what happened this afternoon. Mike. Mark, Mayor Luke Brunin has been considering imposing a mandate here in Hartford for several days, but he says that the COVID numbers here are rising rapidly and the time to act is now. And so we are particularly conscious at this moment. COVID cases continue to rise in Hartford, and today Mayor Luke Bronin responded with a citywide mask mandate. Starting at midnight, everyone over the age of two will need to wear a mask indoors in public. Bronin says Hartford's COVID numbers are about where they were last year, but they've gone up fourfold over the last month. One of the things we have seen in this pandemic is that the time to take action to slow the spread is before it becomes obvious that action is unavoidable. Schools are also going to require everyone to wear a mask. Classes are in person only this year with no remote option. We do share uh, the same uh, commitment and that is to making sure that all of our students, our staff, our families, our community partners are safe. Resident LaShawn Robinson welcomed the news. People were walking around. You didn't really know if they were vaccinated or not. Business owners we talked with don't think the mandate will impact them. In fact, some have been requiring masks since the CDC said last week that Hartford County has a high risk of COVID transmission. At New York Daily and more, they say they're just trying to keep everyone safe. Trying to keep six foot distance, but it's kind of hard sometimes because it gets a lot of people be coming in. Other owners say they were debating whether to bring the mask required signs back. Bronin's order makes things a lot easier for them. If anything, he's made our job a lot easier by making it a mandate. This way it's not up to everybody's individual decision. Businesses can face fines if they fail to enforce the mandate. Bronin says city staff are also making a push to get more people vaccinated. The vaccination rate is especially low among younger people, and Bronin wants to change that. That's why we're doing so much outreach and education. Now, for now, the order is just that people wear masks in businesses. Coming up on Eyewitness News at 6, I'll tell you what Mayor Bronin had to say about the possibility of bringing back other restrictions and the possibility of requiring city employees to get vaccinated. Live from Hartford, Mike Savino, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.